You don't know what's going on. 1247, a great one, man. It's a great day to be great. Uh, you gentlemen, like I always tell you guys, come on to this world, be the greatest version of yourself. Stop listening to this so called community. And handle your business, man. Handle your business. You feel me? Handle your business, be the greatest version of you. Just stop listening to what these women got to say. Especially uh, those who's gaslighting the, the, the past pro bros. <laughs> I gotta get, I, listen, I gotta say my two pieces about this past pro bro situation. But I'm laughing because it's funny how the so called black American man, you know, we've been complaining for decades what we don't like, what we, what we like, what we don't like. Somebody, uh, uh, you know, people didn't take it seriously. Now all of a sudden, brothers is moving out and about. Now all of a sudden, people got problem with you going to different locations on 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 the earth, on on the planet Earth. People got problem now. People got a problem with you, with you gentlemen moving forward. Why do people have a problem? Come on, gentlemen, you gotta, you gotta think, why do people have a problem with you moving forward, man? Does that make any sense? People got a problem with you traveling to these different places for whatever reason? People in your community got a problem. Come on, gentlemen, wake up, man. That makes absolutely no sense. All these different, listen, gentlemen, all these different men can travel all over the world, nobody has a problem with the so-called white man, the Arab man, the Latina, all these African dudes traveling, and you know, these Indian dudes traveling. Nobody has a problem with none of these other people traveling, but you. All of a sudden, you traveling now is a problem. How you doing? So yeah, man. You gotta ask yourself a question. What, what's telling what's, what's really going on, man? See, it seems like to me, man, that these these the masks, these these masks these people been wearing in been, been wearing in the community is starting to wear off, man. Now you starting to see the real hatred for you, brother. You starting to see the real hatred come out. Because you're traveling, because you wanna be happy? Gentlemen, how does you being happy piss people off, man? You being happy is starting to piss people off? Why? Come on, gentlemen, let's see you again. You pissing people off is, is, I mean, I'm sorry, not you piss people off. You being happy is pissing people off. Why? You being assertive is pissing people off. Why? You establishing a purpose of why you even exist is pissing people off. Why? You establishing an SOP, standards of operations and procedure, is pissing people off. Why? You having a vision of where you want to go is pissing people off. Why? Come on, gentlemen. You got to ask yourself a question. Why is that? I mean, you're just being a basic man. Everybody else around you is, has been doing these things for a long time. All of a sudden, you gentlemen are starting to be more vocal about your standards and your purpose and your vision and things that you're doing. And you guys are actually executing and people are, are getting mad in your community. Gentlemen, what's going on, brothers? People are getting mad because you're being a man. Don't say that again. People are getting mad in your community because now you're standing up and you're actually being a man. And that's making people in your so-called community mad. Come on, gentlemen. What's, what's really going on in these streets, man? Huh? The, 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 the magic, the magic, uh, the magic and the sorcery is starting to wear off now. You being the actual man and moving forward and being a leader is pissing people in your community off. That makes absolutely no freaking sense, buddy. 
that makes absolutely no sense whatsoever. I don't see so-called white women getting mad because the so-called white man is being assertive. I don't see Becky and them getting mad because Robert is being assertive. I don't see Maria getting mad that uh, Mario is being assertive and he's moving forward and he has a purpose. Uh, he's established an SOP and he has a vision of where he wants to go. I don't see Maria getting mad. I don't, I don't, I don't see Zhang Kwa getting mad at Peng Lang because Peng Lang is being assertive now. I don't see this. can name any group of man on planet earth no woman is getting mad that that man is being a man and he's moving forward in purpose and establish the SOP and the vision no other woman is getting mad but all of a sudden women in your so-called community are getting mad because now you're being a man come on gentlemen <laughs> <laughs> women in your community are getting mad because now you're being a man you're not you, 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 we, we, we're not chasing ass and titties we're being assertive and we're moving forward in the things that we want to do but that's a problem Come on, gentlemen, stop playing, man. I, I told you, the mask has, has fallen off. The mask has fallen off. The mask that, 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 that all these people around you in the community are starting to fall off. And now you're starting to see the real hatred for it. You're starting to see the real hatred for it. Like I said, you're actually starting to see the real hatred for you. Just by being a man that you were supposed to be, that your, that your father was supposed to be, your grandfather was supposed to be, your great-grandfather was supposed to be, somehow that's a problem in, your, in the so-called, in, in, in the black community. That's a problem. But it's okay when you was out there chasing Big Booty Keisha all day, though, right? That was okay. You could do that all day, but now when you get your passport and you're marrying these different women and you're creating this and you're doing that, now that's a problem. Come on, gentlemen. Wake your ass up, man. Wake your ass up. This is not what you think it is. Wake your ass up. You being a man is a problem for, for your so-called community. It's a, it's a problem, gentlemen. It's a problem. You being a man is a problem for your community, gentlemen. It's time, it's, yo, listen. Move forward and don't look back. Move forward and don't look back. If you being assertive and moving out, getting your passport, doing whatever you're doing, it doesn't even matter about the passport. It's just you just, listen, you being in your masculine frame is a problem for the so-called community. Gentlemen, move forward. Don't look back. Whatever you're gonna do, gentlemen, I suggest you do it quick, fast, and hurt. I told you, gentlemen, this year, masculinity, which starts with you so-called African-American men, was gonna be under attack, gentlemen. The only thing that you're good for is busting a nut and dunking a basketball. That's the only thing you were, that you so-called African-American men were good for. That was it. So yeah, gentlemen, move forward. Brothers out here executing, doing what they want to do. That's a problem. Keep, and people are starting to listen. The thing is, people are starting to listen to what you gentlemen are saying. And that not only are they listening, now they're, they're, they're viewing you. They want to see, okay, cool, these, this Shiraz said X, Y, and Z, let's say he's going to execute. You gentlemen are actually executing on your plans we're, he's saying we're not like the generations before 
You're not like a father's, grandfather's, great-grandfather's. Had all this smoke for the so-called white man. But when it came to the so-called woman, they ain't say nothing. Listen, we a whole, we a whole different generation. You got young brothers out here that we see what's going on. We see what's going on in these neighborhoods. We see what is happening and what ain't happening. And guess what? We're not going to stick around and make excuses. This, that, and the third. We, we moving out. Starting off with the millennial. This is why they have a problem with the millennial generations. Oh, you millennials. You guys just wanted, you guys are doing, you're doing stuff different. Hell yeah, we're doing stuff different. We don't want the same results as, as our fathers, grandfather, great grandfathers. We don't want that same, we don't want these results. So we figured out the formula. We figured out, listen, listen, you gentlemen want results. You got to connect. First of all, you got to connect with them. Um, you got to uh, start in your foundation. You got to connect with women who actually um, who have been trained to be actual wife. You got to be with women who are trained to be actual wives, man. Come on, man. It's just that simple. Any foundation that's going to be, listen, whoever I put my seed into, that's the foundation of my kingdom. And some of you guys are in these neighborhoods, it's like, listen, this is, this is not, this is not it. Come on, man. We figured out the form. We figured it out. We figured it out. Our fathers and them stayed around. We rolling out. So that's not our fault. Once again, if you see a whole bunch, you see a pile of boo-boo, I'm not going to just sit around a pile of boo-boo and be like, oh, okay, well, I know it's stinking, but I'm just, it is what it is. I gotta, I gotta be a man. I gotta man up. Hell nah, man. We moving out. Plain and simple, man. But yeah, Jim, that's all I gotta say, man. I'm not gonna be here for long, man. I'm just, listen, man, I, I, I tell you guys all the time, I'm proud of you brothers. You gentlemen out, out here executing. You said what you said and you're actually moving. And that's why I'm really proud of you guys. Because you actually, you said what you said and you're actually moving forward. You got the whole planet on, on alert. You got the whole entire planet on alert. Because everybody, once again, the thing is, it, it, you know, they, they call us devils. But once again, we're not being the oppressor. You, 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 you uh, oppressor, uh, the aggressor. Do you see us being the aggressor in these situations? No. Do you see us, oh, you better, you know what I'm saying? You see us out here smacking people around and doing this? No, you don't see us doing none of that stuff. So once again, the whole world sees what's going on. The whole world sees what's, what's going on. They see who's being the aggressor in this situation. They see who's who's doing all the bad mouthing and this, that, and the third. The world sees it, gentlemen. All you got to do is keep moving, man. Keep it moving, man, and don't turn back. Shoot, it's Sodom and Gomorrah around this cut, man. Move forward and don't come and don't don't turn back, gentlemen. Create your reality, create the situation that you want. If you go and get a passport, Thailand, Cambodia, uh, 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 Costa Rica, Mexico, Colombia, Brazil, going over there to Africa, man. Shoot, Europe, wherever you go, gentlemen, make it happen. Move forward and don't turn back. I know I've been all I'm in this little thing. I'm all over the place, but yeah, gentlemen, I'm just. I'm, I'm just, I'm just, <laughs> I just want you guys to open your eyes. I want to see what's, uh, open your eyes and see what's really going on around you. All right, it is what it is, it is what it ain't. And guess what, I'm not here to fix something that you're, that, 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 like this. We are not here to fix things that people are not willing to fix themselves. You got to understand that. Even me being here in Georgia, listen, I see all types of stuff going on. Listen, I'm not here to fix stuff that people are not willing to fix themselves. What's the, what's the song by Lil John? If you don't give a damn, I don't give a F. If you don't give a damn about your situation, then I don't give a F about your situation. I'm not gonna give a damn if you don't give a damn. Understand, gentlemen? It's not up to you to come and do what your granddaddy and them did. No, people don't care about their situation. You not supposed don't you you're not supposed to give a damn about the situation. That's not how it works. That people want to listen. If people want to sit in squalor and filth. Let let, let them people sit in squalor and filth. I'm not about to fix that shit. 
the ish. I shouldn't be cursing. I shouldn't, I'm not going to fix it. Neither should you. If you see the situation looking looking ran down, ran through, your, you know, you go through the old neighborhood, it's looking ran down, ran through, and them people in that neighborhood and not trying to fix that, don't. That's not your. that's not your position to go and fix something that somebody else is not willing to do. That, that, that'd, be, that'd be dumb. You're wasting resources, you're wasting your, your work and energy, all types of stuff because people in that situation don't want to move. Oh, well, keep it moving. But yeah, gentlemen, that's all I got to say, man. That's all I got to say. I know I've been all over, you know, all over the place with this conversation. But yeah, gentlemen, you said what you said, and now you're moving forward. You know, just recognize, listen, listen, just recognize, listen. The thing is, don't, don't, you, you, we ain't got to announce to the world what we're doing. You know, let's, now let's listen, listen, let's move in silence now. Let's, let's be like, let's be like some, uh, 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 Rangers. You know, if you have, you've been in the military, you got special forces, be special forces now. You may got to tell people your business. Just move out. Just move out. You ain't got to tell people, you ain't got to sit there and tell people all your business. And, oh, I'm doing this, oh, I'm doing, nah, man, gentlemen, move out. Shut your mouth, put your head, put your, you put your head down, make those plans, and just move. You ain't gotta let your mama and them know. You, you don't have to let, you don't have to let anybody know anything. You a grown ass man, move forward. All right, man. That's all I got to say, man. You gentlemen, like I said, I'm once again I'm proud of you, gentlemen. You said what you said, and now you're moving forward. Now you got the whole you you especially got the community buzzing. Got the whole planet buzzing. Everybody else can move around, vacation, and go here, go there. Nobody says nothing to the so-called white man. When he moved down to these different places, doing all types of stuff, nobody says nothing. But also, as soon as you start rolling out, oh, everybody got a problem. Passport Brothers, SYSBM. Anyways, man, gentlemen, stay up. Like, share, and subscribe, man. And um, hit up my PayPal and my cash app, man. Show me some love. Give me some thumbs up so I can get my name circling in, uh, in the algorithm because they're trying to, they're trying to trying to shadow ban, uh, shadow ban me a little bit, but it's all good, man. We'll keep it moving. Then you got to stay up. Peace.